A scaffolding scare in downtown Milwaukee. Two workers are rescued today after a suspended piece of scaffolding partially collapses right above the Milwaukee County Courthouse. This was scary stuff. Fox 6's Bria Jones joins us live. I know you're downtown by the courthouse and we've got some new action happening out there. We do know Ben said thankfully no one was hurt during this situation. But again, as you mentioned, I want to get you right into the action. Take a look behind me. This scaffold is now finally coming down. This is after six hours later, after two workers were rescued from the basket of, as you can see, this now secured scaffold. Shocking video shows a suspenseful scaffolding situation unfolding above the Milwaukee County Courthouse. One of the scaffolders uh, broke in. The workers are hanging. Well, it is visually spectacular. Uh, it is, uh, it has been brought to a safe conclusion. It's the best ending to the story. Milwaukee Fire Chief Aaron Lipsky says the department's heavy urban rescue team responded just before 3 p.m. They found two workers trapped in the basket of a partially collapsed scaffold above the 11 story building. We were ready to go over the edge and, and go down and, and conduct a, a rope rescue on these individuals. But these folks that are working on this site are highly skilled. They, this is their this is their work environment. Lipsky says a Spanish speaking firefighter was quickly sent to bridge a language barrier. From there, first responders and the crew worked in tandem to make the rescue and double secure the scaffolds. We were up there to make sure that they were in fact secured with rescue harnesses. They were able to, uh, I don't know if you were able to see, they shimmied across that ledge, got to the uh, fully functioning scaffolding. They were raised up to the roof and brought over. Miraculously, no one was hurt and the workers did not require medical attention. There was no fall. There was no injury, even though the thing was, you know, canted like that. Uh, they had capable co-workers in place. It appears the crew was with Berkeley Construction. The courthouse was built almost 100 years ago. The sheriff's office says the crew was working on phase three of a facade restoration project. They're keeping a watchful eye over the space. We were concerned that potentially some equipment was going to come down. That didn't happen, thankfully. Now, right now, you can see that two other pieces of scaffolding remain on top of the building. We're told that that equipment is secure. Right now, you can see they are working to remove that dangling piece that was up in the air for several hours, hours tonight. Now, I did contact Bergland Construction today. Uh, someone over the phone told me the company had absolutely no comment. Now, I want to get to a statement from County Executive David Crowley. He says tonight, in part, the cause of the incident will be fully investigated before any work resumes. We're live tonight. Bria Jones, Fox 6 News. Have you been able to see it like come down? Is it just very slowly at, at a time? Looks like it's back stuck again. It's slowly coming down. So probably in the last like 10 minutes, uh, it's probably moved at, at least a good 10 feet. So it's it's slowly but surely coming oh, yeah. down. They're Look taking their time. It's kind of coming down and then it's going back up. So I'm not really sure how long it will take them to get it down. But I'm told that they have a crane and then once the, they get it down, they're going to move the crane. It has to come through this path right here. It reminds me of my blinds at home. Like, you, know, <laughs> you play with the cords and it never comes down right. So, wow, wild scene. Glad everybody's okay. Bria, thanks.